Hey Bruce Biddies, what is up? My name is Jared from Jared Gaming, and today we're going to be building a sports car in Minecraft. Now, a lot of you guys like these sports cars, and some of you guys don't. So these are the people that really like these cars. Um, I am still doing other stuff, but I just want to, you know, expand my horizon and build some stuff that other people like. So we're going to go ahead and make a sports car today. Um, now this is like a snazzy sports car in Minecraft. This could be good for, you know, in the parking lot or, you know, if on the side of the road or things like that in your modern city just cruising around. So I'm going to go ahead and tell you guys the blocks that we're going to go ahead and need. And those is uh, quartz stairs, block of coal, a stone button, uh, snow, and if you guys are going to use snow, uh, make sure that you guys don't put this near lights because it will melt. So if you guys don't want to use snow, you guys can also use iron trap doors, which we're going to be using on this, but we'll get to that in a minute. But if you guys want to not use snow, you guys can replace the snow slabs with uh, quartz. I meant um, iron trap doors, because they, they won't melt. <laughs> quartz slab, black, stained glass, uh, iron trap door, signs, and item frames. We're also going to go ahead and need yellow stained glass, red stained glass, daylight sensor, and black stained glass panes. Uh, so what we're going to go ahead and do is we're going to go ahead and start to build this. I'm going to build this next to the one that's already built so that way it makes it a little bit easier on me. What we're going to go ahead, oh, my keys messed up. What we're going to go ahead and do is I'm just going to place it wherever. You guys remember this is a three block wide by, how long is this? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten blocks um, long. If you guys want the front stuff, I would have at least twelve blocks clearance. So a 12 block gap to make sure that we can fit everything on it just in case. So I wouldn't keep it next to another parked car, you know, too close. What we're going to go ahead and do is start by placing a uh, court stair like so. Then go sideways and sideways like this. We're going to go upside down court stair there. Upside down court stair here. And a quartz block here. We're going to go ahead and place a block of coal here. A block of coal there. And another quartz block going to go ahead and place a stone button, item frame, stone button, item frame. We're going to go ahead and place one, two, three blocks of quartz. Then we're going to skip one block, place one block of coal, skip one block, place one block of coal, rotate, place an upside down quartz stair, place an upside down quartz stair. Go ahead and place a sign on the side of that quartz stair like so, and another one on that side. So if you guys do not have this, make sure you guys go ahead and do this, and uh, before we continue. Okay, what we're going to go ahead and do is place, oops, place a quartz block here, one, two, three blocks of coal. Go ahead and place one, two, three blocks of um, black stained glass on top of that. We're going to come here in the back like so, place a block of quartz one block of quartz here, one block of quartz here, place our um, black stained glass there. We're going to go ahead and place um, three blocks of quartz on top, three blocks of quartz like this, turn, two blocks, and then four blocks of uh, quartz like so. We're then going to add an overhang underneath of it, like this, and then here in the front, coming um, we're going to remove these tops here, like that. So it should look just like this, so if you guys don't have that. There you guys go. We're going to go ahead and place a snow block there, a snow block there. Uh, we'll get to the daylight sensors later. A sign here, just blank. Item frame there, item frame there. And we'll continue on to the back. We're going to place a trap, an iron trap door on top of all these parts here. So that's how that should look. We're going to go ahead and place three blocks in the back. I wonder if I can do it on these. I don't know. I used the other ones before. Yep, we can. We just need to make sure that these are upside down um, court stairs and then court stairs like so. And lastly, court slabs. So that's how that should look. We're going to go ahead and place a stone button on top of that black hole. Place an item frame next to it. Button and then item frame, item frame here and here, and then a license plate. I'm going to type Jared Gaming on mine because I built it. Um, what we're going to go ahead and do is so you guys can type anything you guys really want. It's just a license plate so you guys don't have to have anything that you guys don't want to have. But we can get rid of these blocks here. We're 
we're going to trade them out for the other ones that we need, which are yellow stained glass, red stained glass, daylight sensor, and black stained glass pane. We're going to go ahead and insert the black stained glass pane into the tire wheels for the hubcaps. For adding a little bit more detail, we're going to add two daylight sensors on the front, like so. In the front, we're going to add yellow stained glass blocks. You guys can also use glass panes for this. It doesn't matter. I'm just going to go ahead and use blocks. And we're going to add the red ones in the back. So that's how that should look. Um, and that's really it, guys. That's how you guys build the vehicle. Make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe, guys. I hope you guys enjoy this tutorial as much as I like making it. This tutorial was made by... Um, this build was actually made by the Diamond555 on my Minecraft PC server. So thank you to him for designing these vehicles for us so that way we can have them. He's been helping me out so that way I have a little bit more time to record. Um, if you guys want to come on the Minecraft PC server and show me some of your guys' builds and cool creations, you guys can join. The server IP is in the description of this video. As always, thanks for watching, guys.